Rodney Gordon, the president of the Morgan County chapter of the NAACP, says the vigil was all about love, something he says the Perkins family needs right now. If we're going to beat this thing, it's going to take love. Yes. Love got to keep us, hold us, sustain us. Jesus, I know that. Prayer, songs of faith, healing. More than 100 people chose to spend Thanksgiving morning lifting up the family of Steve Perkins. The president of the Morgan County NAACP says having the vigil and communion was perfect for what the community is going through right now. You know, c communion is, 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 a, is a covenant. The covenant brings, unifies, just brings us together. And that's what it's all about. Rodney Gordon says on days usually meant to be full of happiness, many in the community say they're hurting. Gordon says the decision was made then to hold this event specifically at the Morgan County Courthouse. We got we got to stay prayed up, feed, continue to feed our spiritual man yes. because we're dealing with spiritual wickedness in high places. One pastor tells me the turnout of the vigil thrilled her. She says it's a sign the Decatur community, no matter how different, can come together in unity. In studio with coverage you can count on, Matt Paskowitz, Way 31 News.